Well, I think uh, defensively, we uh, thought we played a pretty good game. Um, we had a young guy, Luke Rhodes, step up. The Andre Houston Carson step up when some people got hurt. So uh, I think that was that was a plus for us. Uh, we're going to Lafayette, feeling pretty good. Uh, for the most part, everybody's healthy, which is uh, which is big for the tribe. Offensively, I haven't talked to too many of the guys, but you know they're going to go out this week, do what they have to do, figure out what our quarterback situation is, and go out and play against Lafayette. Uh, but I think for a team, I mean, we go in against an ACC team, and I really do think we controlled the game for the majority of the time we were there. Uh, we just got to be able to finish at the end of the game. Um, our motto as a team is uh, we have your back, you have ours. So defensively, uh, first drive, we get a pick. We tell our offense, like, go ahead, score. We have your back. Uh, offensively, if they go down and score, they're going to tell us, you know what, go ahead and stop them, give us the ball back. So. We, uh, we really don't feel like the offense or defense has to carry each other. We really feel like uh, at this point with what we have done in camp so far, we know what the offense can do and they know what we can do. So we, spe we expect to go stop the offense and offense expects to go score. Well, coming from a, a defensive line point of view, I mean, the past uh, eight years here with the defensive line has been unbelievable. I mean, you have Sean Lissamore playing in the NFL now, Adrian Tracy playing in the NFL now. So I mean, there's just a rich tradition right now at defensive line, which is, which is really cool for me to be able to say like I know I know some of these guys that are playing in the NFL. But as a defense overall, I mean, it's just a mentality for us that we want to go out, we want to win every game, we want to play every snap to the best of our ability. Um, so I think that's going to help our confidence and and really take us to the next level. But uh, yeah, so I think uh, as as a confidence of our defense right now, I think we're we're on the right track. Uh, well, I mean, we had to do it for Maryland because uh, we had an idea with their offensive coordinator coming from New Mexico um, and their defensive coordinator coming from Houston. But, I mean, it is hard because at the end of the day, you really don't know what they're going to do. Um, but going against Lafayette, we're going to go off their, what they've done in the past, which we think they're going to run the ball. Uh, they like their fullbacks and running backs coming from my defensive um, perspective. But uh, at the end of the day, you just got we just have to go out and just play our defense. Um, if we do what we're supposed to do, we should be able to stop them. I mean, well, it's great. You know, it's the beginning of the year, so the students are all fired up as well. So uh, they'll have fun before the game. We'll, 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 feel it. we'll feel like the energy probably starting Thursday for everybody getting excited about the game. And then Friday, you know, it, it's good having a pre, going to the CAF, have a pregame meal, and people say good luck before the games and everything. And then, you know, just Saturday, just coming out to Zabel, I mean, just having everyone come and support you. Um, I love playing at Sable. Uh, it's a great environment there. I mean, we, we almost sell out every single home game. And uh, I mean, you just get to play in front of the people that really, that really appreciate it. We pre really appreciate you and just want to come out and watch you, so it's great.